attention. All hints and tips shown here are personal experiences and serve as support. The repair is at your own risk. Hint repairing tools. All repairing tools used by us in the video can be found in our webshop. Just follow the links in the video description. Unfortunately, we can only recommend this repair for professionals. The battery cover and also the battery are extremely strongly glued. So there is an increased risk of irreversible damage when opening the device and removing the battery. In addition, it is necessary to fix the battery cover with special liquid adhesive for getting a perfect result. This also requires well-founded experience. Please write us in the comments on how difficult you felt the repair. Removing the back cover. Power off the device. Remove the SIM card tray. Heat the battery cover along its edges. The battery cover is glued extremely strong. Therefore, we recommend opening the battery cover with an opening pliers. Using a suction cup will surely require even more patience to remove the battery cover. Fix the suction cup of the opening pliers on the lower area of the screen and the battery cover. Pull apart the suction cup of the opening pliers and simultaneously try to slide a thin and flexible plastic tool between battery cover and screen frame. As soon as you succeed, the plastic tool can get stuck as a placeholder. Heat the battery cover again in between. Take a plectrum tool as support and pull it once around the whole battery cover to solve the adhesive. If needed, do also use a second plectrum tool. As soon as the adhesive is released completely, you can remove the battery cover. Removing components of the LCD screen unit to transfer them to the new screen. Remove the foil from one of the screws with a tweezer. Remove seven screws cross from the loudspeaker module. Warm the heat protection slightly and release it step by step in the area of the upper mainboard. You do not have to release the adhesive of the heat protection from the lower area. Do first only fold down the heat protection downwards. Remove nine several screws cross in the area of the upper mainboard. Remove the narrow cover plate. Remove the upper covering with the Flex for Flesh after you have released it with the help of the Plectrum tool.
release the battery connector with the help of the spudger. Do also release the upper connector of the flat cable. Release the loudspeaker module including the fixed heat protection and remove it. Now you can release the second connector of the flat cable and remove it. Release the antenna cable from the upper mainboard with the help of the tweezer. Use the spudger to release one connector from the lower mainboard. Release the connector of the camera module and remove the camera. Do also release the front camera module and remove it. Release the upper mainboard carefully with the spudger and remove it. Do also release and remove the speaker module. Remove the lower mainboard with the help of the spudger. In the next step, we will show you how to remove the battery. This step is not required in all cases. For the Huawei Honor 10, you will get new LCD screens including or excluding the battery. We strongly suggest using a new screen including the battery, because it is very hard to remove the battery without damage. If you want to replace a defective battery, please be very careful while levering out the battery. Do not exert too much pressure to prevent damaging the LCD screen. Removing the battery. Heat the battery slightly from the front side of the LCD screen. Use a thin and flexible plastic tool, for example a shortened chip card or a plectrum tool, to release the adhesive under the battery. Release the adhesive carefully around the battery and heat the battery again if needed. As soon as the adhesive is released completely, you can remove the battery. If you want to reuse the battery, you have to straighten it if needed. Fixing the battery on the new LCD screen unit. Hint: We suggest using double-faced universal adhesive for fixing the battery. In our case, we reused the old adhesive because it was still strong enough. Insert the battery, arrange it and push it solid. Transferring components of the old LCD screen unit to the new one. Insert the lower mainboard and push it down slightly until it is locked in completely. Link one connector to the lower mainboard. Thread the antenna cable into the screen covering. Insert the upper mainboard and push it down slightly until it is locked in completely. Link the flex connector to the upper mainboard.
Lay down the flat cable and link it to the upper mainboard as well as to the lower mainboard. Insert the speaker module and fix it by pushing slightly. Insert the front camera module and link it to the upper mainboard. Do also insert the camera module and connect it. Link the battery connector. Power on the device and test it for functionality. Power off the device. Link the antenna cable to the upper mainboard. Lay down the upper covering with the flex for flesh and push it solid. Fix six screws across in the area of the upper mainboard. Insert the narrow cover plate and fix it with three screws, cross. Insert the loudspeaker module including the heat protection and push it slightly until it is locked in. Fix the loudspeaker module with seven screws cross. Fix the heat protection again in the area of the upper mainboard. Closing the device. It is recommended using special liquid adhesive for fixing the battery cover if you want to have a perfect result. We suggest removing the old adhesive residuals completely from the battery cover before applying the liquid adhesive. Apply a thin layer of the liquid adhesive on the edge of the screen.
start in the upper area to lay down the battery cover on the LCD screen and adjust it by orientating on the camera. Use a cloth to push the battery cover solid. Finally clean the battery cover as well as the frame of the LCD screen with a cloth soaked in spirit. Insert the SIM card tray. Power on the device and test it for functionality again. Power off the device. We look forward to your comments and if you like the video do not forget to click thumbs up. Please let us know if you have questions or suggestions for future videos.